The Bhagavad Gita is not just for one religion. It is meant to be read and understood by every human on earth so that they can attain happiness, peace, and success in their lives. There are a total of 18 chapters in the Bhagavad Gita containing a total of 700 verses. Reading them all can be a bit challenging for everyone. Therefore, in today's very special video, we will discuss 111 thoughts from the Bhagavad Gita, which, when you learn, you will understand the true meaning of the human life. So listen to these thoughts every morning. One should perform their duties selflessly, without concern for the results, without greed or attachment. Just as a lamp shines in the darkness, similarly, truth always shines. Therefore, one should always walk the path of truth. A person who lacks knowledge and faith in the divine can never attain happiness and success in life. Just as a person discards old clothes and wears new ones, in the same way, the soul discards old, useless bodies and takes on new, physical bodies, avoiding involvement in who is doing what, how, and why can lead to greater happiness. When an intelligent person stops maintaining a relationship, it's important to understand that their self-esteem may have been hurt in some way. Do not develop attachment to what you have no rightful claim to, even if you have the right. Those who empathize with others' suffering, have compassion, and are genuinely good at heart don't need to be reborn. For an enlightened person, dirt, stones, and gold are all the same. Your actions define your identity. Otherwise, there are thousands with the same name. Love always prefers to seek forgiveness, and ego always prefers to receive apologies. Constantly thinking about worldly matters leads to attachment, which leads to desire, and desire, when obstructed, leads to anger. For those who constantly doubt, there is neither happiness in this world nor anywhere else. Actions are the seeds that one must sow in every circumstance. Always sow good seeds so that the harvest is good. What is meant to happen will happen, and what is not meant to happen will never occur. Those with such certainty in their minds are never troubled by worry. Even if you do good deeds, people may remember only your flaws, so don't pay attention to what others say. Just keep doing your work. Remaining silent as much as possible is a virtue because most of the sins committed by humans are through their speech. Those who lack faith in devotion cannot attain me. Therefore, they keep returning to the cycle of birth and death in this physical world. The best response for someone who doesn't value your words is silence. Adapt with time or learn to change time. Don't keep pushing against circumstances. Learn to go with the flow. It's okay to worry about something, but don't let the worry become so excessive that it spoils the task at hand. A task done with good intentions is never in vain, and you will certainly reap its rewards. The Lord says, I do not determine anyone's destiny. Each person shapes their own fate. What you are doing today, you will reap the consequences of tomorrow, and what you have today is the result of your past actions. It's not that a person is good or bad, but their actions determine their destiny. Just as a person's actions are, so are the results they attain. You only have the right to perform your actions, but you are not the owner of the results of those actions. Do not attach yourself either to being the cause of the results or to not performing the actions. The right action 
is not one whose results are always right, but the right action is one whose intent is never wrong. In this world, no one is endowed with all virtues, so overlook some shortcomings and maintain relationships. Living as yourself, recognizing your imperfections, is better than trying to imitate someone else's life of perfection. When the future seems uncertain, focus on the present to find clarity. Keep trying, a solution will emerge. If not today, then tomorrow. Like an arrow from Arjuna, water will even flow from a desert. The biggest mistake in life is the one from which we don't learn anything. When our mind is weak, situations become problems. And when the mind is strong, situations become opportunities. And when our mind is strong, circumstances become opportunities. Humanity in a person is lost the moment they find amusement in the suffering of others. Taking a life within a body can never be justified. Therefore, there is no need to mourn for any living being. Time teaches us that life doesn't wait for anyone and doesn't stop for anyone. Life is like a game played with different players. Pain is the same for all, but the courage to face it varies. A person should not be preoccupied with worrying about the potential outcomes of their actions, whether it be victory or defeat, gain or loss, joy or sorrow, and so on. If you learn from your mistakes, then mistakes are like stairs, and if you don't learn, mistakes are like an ocean. The decision to ascend or drown is yours. Problems are not as powerful as we perceive them to be. Have you ever heard that darkness never allows morning to come? Seeking out mistakes is not wrong. It should begin with oneself. It's not necessary that your words are always understood correctly. Sometimes silence is a better option. The more peaceful one is, the deeper they can use their intellect. Don't be deterred by criticism when you're on the path to success because opinions change when you achieve your goal. Your victory or defeat depends on your thinking, so believe you will lose, and you will. Believe you will win, and you will. The wisest and most stable-minded person is the one who doesn't become arrogant in success and doesn't drown in sorrow in failure. When you receive praise, be extra cautious. In life, never compare yourself to anyone. You are the best as you are. A person is built by their beliefs. As they believe, so they become. For the one who has conquered the mind, the mind becomes their greatest friend. But for the one who couldn't, their mind becomes their greatest enemy. Negative thoughts are bound to come, but it depends on how much importance you give them. Always remember, to reach better days, you have to fight through the tough ones. Nothing in life is permanent, so don't stress too much because circumstances, no matter how bad, will change for sure. No matter how much troublemakers may seem, they can never be greater than the grace of the divine. The biggest source of inspiration is your own thoughts, so think big and always motivate yourself to win. The one who has conquered the mind has already attained the divine as they have found peace. For such a person, happiness and sorrow, cold and heat, respect and disrespect are all the same. Difficulties come only to those who are capable of dealing with them in the best way because they have the ability to give it a positive outcome. No matter what anyone says, just keep yourself calm because a storm, no matter how fast it is, cannot dry the ocean. Where you have no value, it's inappropriate to stay, whether it's someone's home or their heart. When someone leaves your hand and both hands are empty, nature sends someone to hold your finger. 
they are called Krishna. The one who doesn't control their mind, their mind works as their biggest enemy. A person can become whatever they want if they constantly think about their desired goal with faith. Only the one who knows when and where to lose in relationships, when and where to give in to circumstances, becomes a true winner, not just in front of the world, but in relationships as well. People who get lost in emotions, instead of using their intellect, can be considered foolish by everyone. Things obtained before their time lose their value, and things obtained after time gain importance. One should not be preoccupied with worries about the possible outcomes of their actions, whether it's victory or defeat, gain or loss, happiness or sorrow. The soul leaves the old body just like a person changes old clothes and puts on new ones. Just as a boat floating in water is carried away from its course by a storm, similarly, sensory pleasures lead a person in the wrong direction. Your belief can move mountains, but your mind's doubt can create new mountains. Having faith in oneself is crucial because we walk our own paths. Time is never the same. Even those who unnecessarily make others cry eventually have to cry themselves. Empower yourself through the power of your will. Never belittle yourself with self-doubt. Desire is both a person's best friend and worst enemy. It depends on how one uses it. Don't blame the world for your suffering. Understand your own mind. Changing your mind is the solution to your pain. Never consider yourself weak. If you fall, make an effort to get up. Fight with complete dedication and leave the rest to me. Not every day may be good, but there's something good in every day. Keep patience. Sometimes you have to go through the worst phases in life to reach the best. Stop crying and learn to fight your own battles with your troubles, for even those who help eventually do not go beyond the cremation grounds. When time delivers justice, there's no need for witnesses. A gift becomes real and sacred only when it is given with no expectation of receiving something in return. Beauty is in your perspective. A lotus can enchant in the mud, and the moon can have spots in someone's view. God says, I strengthen the belief of those who worship any deity with complete faith in that deity. Rising is never sudden. Even the sun rises slowly and steadily. Patience and perseverance can illuminate the world gaining heaven and residing there for many years. After that, an unsuccessful yogi is born into a pure and prosperous family. Only speak the words you're willing to take back. Let yourself be hurt if necessary. Controlling the mind when it is disturbed is difficult, but it can be achieved through practice. There's a difference between ego and self-respect. Ego thrives by putting others down, while self-respect is content in itself. Serve everyone but don't expect anything in return, because the true value of service can only be given by the divine. When truth fights falsehood, truth stands alone, and falsehood's army is vast because it consists of fools. Living alone teaches you that, in reality, you have nothing except yourself. When family members start seeming unpleasant and strangers start feeling like your own, understand that the time of destruction has begun. Anger doesn't need strength to shout, but it requires great strength to stay silent when anger arises. What's meant for you will always come to you, even if the whole world unites to take it away. My, yours, small, big, ours, and theirs, all erase from the mind, and then everything is yours, and you belong to everyone. When the beginning of destruction happens, 
it begins with the loss of self-control over speech. In life, nothing truly ends. There's always a new beginning waiting for us. If you want to be happy in life, pay more attention to what you have, not what others have. The day all our worries will end is the day we have complete faith that everything we do is by the will of the divine. Patience in adversity, compassion in abundance, and endurance in difficulty are the marks of great individuals. A person who speaks clearly and directly may have a harsh tongue, but they never deceive anyone. Embrace what feels good and let go of what feels bad, whether it's thoughts, actions, or people. Evil, whether big or small, is always the cause of destruction. Just like even a small hole in a boat can sink it. Donating without respect or honor is called tamasic charity. Families and societies start to deteriorate when wise people become silent and fools start speaking. You can't go back and you can't change the beginning, but you can start where you are and change the ending. When hope seems to be shattered and no path is visible, then take refuge in the watching of this video again. See you in the next video. I wish you all the very best. I support your dreams with I Can I Will.